Do you have a favorite animal you enjoy drawing? Many of my paintings include horses. My name is Horace Pippin, and I was born on February 22, 1888 in Pennsylvania. Even though I've never had one art lesson, I'm considered one of America's greatest artists. I began to draw pictures and keep notes to help me get through the war. My family had moved from Pennsylvania to Goshen, New York. It had a big hotel and a horse racing track. I drew pictures of horses and harness drivers. I went to school for a while, but I had to quit school to get a job to support my brother, sister, and mother. The events that inspired me as a young adult were World War I, which I fought in, and I started to use brighter color in my paintings after seeing paintings by French Impressionist artist Pierre Auguste Renoir. One of my paintings is Man on a Bench. That painting is important because it was my last painting. I made it to show how I felt as I grew older. I surrounded the man with beautiful glowing fall leaves in my famous warm red. Another painting was Captain in the Cotton. I depicted slaves working in the cotton field. I really like to paint real life events. Finally, another one of my famous paintings, Holy Mountain, was made, which showed peace with the animals and war in the background because I still have memories of the war. I fought heroically in the battlefields of France. Sometimes we spent months living in cold, muddy trenches while mortar shells exploded around us. It seemed like the only good thing about the experience was that I got back to my heart. I got the idea to burn wood panels while sitting in front of my wood-burning stove. I took the hot metal poker and used it to burn a drawing into a section of my dining room table. It was hard for me to draw with my injured arm, but when I finished, I was very proud of my work. If you like to draw, then maybe you can become an artist when you grow up, too.